Hey there, space enthusiasts and curious minds. Have you ever looked up at the night sky and wondered, are we alone? It's a question that's puzzled humans for centuries. Today, we're diving into a cosmic mystery. Why is Earth the only known planet with life? Get ready for a journey through space, time, and the very essence of what makes our planet special. Let's start with a mind-blowing fact. There are billions of galaxies in the observable universe. Each of these galaxies contains billions of stars, and many of these stars have their own planetary systems. With so many planets out there, why haven't we found life anywhere else? The answer lies in a concept called the Goldilocks Zone. This zone is the area around a star where conditions are just right for liquid water to exist on a planet's surface. Earth sits comfortably in this zone, not too hot and not too cold. But being in the Goldilocks Zone isn't enough on its own. Let's look at what makes Earth so special. First, we have water, lots of it. About 71% of Earth's surface is covered in water. Water is essential for life as we know it. It acts as a solvent, allowing for chemical reactions that are necessary for life. Next up, our atmosphere. Earth's atmosphere is a perfect blend of gases that support life. It's mostly nitrogen and oxygen, with small amounts of other gases. This atmosphere protects us from harmful radiation and helps regulate our planet's temperature. Speaking of temperature, Earth's climate is relatively stable. Our planet's tilt and orbit create seasons, but overall, temperatures remain within a range that's suitable for life. Another crucial factor is Earth's magnetic field. This invisible shield protects us from solar wind and cosmic radiation. Without it, our atmosphere would be stripped away, leaving us vulnerable to the harsh conditions of space. Earth also has the right chemical composition. Our planet is rich in elements like carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, and oxygen, the building blocks of life. These elements are found in the right proportions and forms to support complex organic molecules. Let's not forget about plate tectonics. This geological process recycles nutrients and helps regulate Earth's carbon cycle. It's also responsible for creating diverse environments where life can thrive. Time has played a crucial role too. Life on Earth has had billions of years to evolve and adapt. This long period of stability has allowed for the development of complex life forms. Now, you might be wondering, what about other planets in our solar system? Mars, often called Earth's cousin, has shown signs of past water activity. But its atmosphere is too thin to support liquid water on the surface today. Venus, similar in size to Earth, is far too hot due to a runaway greenhouse effect. Its surface temperature is hot enough to melt lead. Jupiter's moon Europa has a subsurface ocean, but it's covered by a thick layer of ice. While there's potential for microbial life there, conditions are very different from Earth. Saturn's moon Titan has liquid on its surface, but it's methane, not water. The temperatures there are far too cold for life as we know it. So, why haven't we found life elsewhere? It could be that we're looking in the wrong places or for the wrong signs. Maybe life exists in forms we can't yet recognize or detect. Or perhaps the conditions that allowed life to develop on Earth are rarer than we think. But don't lose hope. Our search for extraterrestrial life is ongoing. Scientists are developing new technologies and methods to detect signs of life on distant planets. Who knows what we might discover in the coming years? As we wrap up our cosmic journey, let's take a moment to appreciate our unique home. Earth truly is a remarkable planet, perfectly tuned for life. What do you think? Are we alone in the universe, or is it just a matter of time before we discover other living worlds?